Amid splits in the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, there are still plenty of TLC couples going strong in 2022. Since its inception in 2014, there have been several pairs of cast members on the show that have gotten married or never even made it to the altar. Over the course of nine years, 18 different spin-offs have given fans a fly-on-the-wall view of many couples and their dynamics. It's not surprising that these relationships that get scrutinized every week on international TV often fall apart with their age gaps, disapproving families, language barriers, and cultural differences. Still, some couples have found everlasting love thanks to 90 Day Fiancé, which apart from giving them fans across the world, has provided them with fame and wealth. In 2022, several couples such as Chantelle Everett and Pedro Jimeno, Paul Stale and Kareem Martins, Mark and Nikki Shoemaker, Yvareano and Mohamed Abdelhamed, and Devin Clegg and Jihoon headed toward divorce. Yet, on the plus side, many unassuming couples are living their best lives, overcoming all odds to become each other's ideal match. Jasmine Pineda Gino Palazzolo When Jasmine was introduced to 90 Day Fiancé fans as the possessive, gold digger girlfriend of divorced man Gino on 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days Season 3, many predicted the relationship would end in flames. Jasmine almost broke up with Gino when she discovered he had leaked her nudes to his ex-girlfriend. While this came at the cost of Jasmine losing her teaching job in Panama, she still chose to stay with Gino. In 2022, Jasmine revealed her K-1 visa was pre-approved, and while she is still in her home country, she will be coming over to the States in 2023 and perhaps even starring in 90 Day Fiancé Season 10. Debbie Johnson Tony 13 years after Colt Johnson's mother Debbie lost her husband Harley to a massive heart attack, she underwent a makeover and found herself a new boyfriend. Debbie's first 90 day, the single life season 2 stint was unsuccessful. However, in season 3, she met Tony from Canada, although it came at the risk of ruining her relationship with Colt. Debbie and Tony not only declared their love for each other after just one meeting, but she also moved to Canada in a shocking turn of events. Debbie and Tony are still together in 2022, and by the looks of it, might get married in 2023. Annie Su Wan David Toborowski Annie and David from 90 Day Fiancé Season 5 have a 24-year age gap, and despite having faced troubles with money and family in the past, have made their relationship last. Annie and David spent 2022 focusing on their health and happiness and have shown off their riches as well. The couple bought not one but three houses, with Annie now owning two beach properties in Thailand, and the Pillow Talk pair purchased a $550,000 four-bedroom home in Arizona. It's not just their net worth that is flourishing, Annie and David are supposedly having a baby as well, making 2022 an especially big year for the 90-day fiancé couple. Source, Jasmine Pineda Debbie Johnson David Toborowski, Instagram.